Welcome back craft beer lovers. Um, I'm going to try something different today. Um, this is the first one that I've had from these guys. They're called Club Brewing and basically they're sort of, I guess like home brewers, but they're basically collaborating with uh, big brewers and um, they each month they collaborate with a few different brewers and they send out some beers. Now it says, quite interestingly, it says Club Brewing Co. Um, was born in the garage in two th January 2016. If you're brewing, if you're uh, drinking this beer, then you're a member. If not, you must have really good friends. Um, my friend is Susan Bannister, so thanks Susan Bannister for uh, sending this down. We have um, a bit of a beer exchange happening now. This one is um, a uh, collaboration with Mountain Goat, and it's called Hazed and Confused. Uh, it's a, it's got Belgian, or it's called Belgian Pomegranate. Um, interestingly, it says collaborating with Mountain Goat is pretty cool. Uh, goat brewer Craig Westy Westwood loved the idea of pom uh, pomegranate saison. Our only holdback was that we couldn't source the saison yeast we wanted, so we morphed this into a Belgian type thing, which is dry and has some farmhouse qualities. The hero of the beer is the pomegranate, which brings some definite tardiness. It's spritzy, it's summery, and smashable, so be careful. Special thanks to Zach for inspiring this beer. So it sounds quite interesting, um, yeah, and I uh, don't think I've probably had anything like that before, so 5.8%, uh, IBU 15, sounds good, uh, perfect for a, uh, uh, an autumn day, not summer, but near enough, pour this into a dirty glass, but anyway, that's okay, oh, I should get a little bit extra flavour from the Keiju Crush, which I just had. You can smell it. That's what it looks like in a glass. It's quite dark. I guess pomegranate's usually like a red, pinky colour, sort of something like the colour of the label there. So, probably expect it to be a little bit... Uh, I would probably expect it to be a little bit red. Anyway, you can smell the yeast. Um, which you get in the Belgian. Bam! Um, yeah, really strong. Um, you know, not that I've had a lot of pomegranate, but when you do, it's sort of like a pretty intense flavour. It's a really sharp flavour, um, quite bitey, tangy, uh, similar to passion fruit, but sort of. I don't know, maybe a little bit sweeter, a bit like between a plum and a passion fruit sort of thing, if that makes any sense. Um, you can smell the Belgian yeast, which is quite nice. It's got a nice sort of creamy head, which looks good. That's very tasty. Um, I'm trying to think what it's a bit like. Um, a bit like Wayward Sourpuss, if you've had that before, um, which has a Berliner wise with raspberries in it. Um, Probably, there's, a, there's certainly some subtle differences there, um, but yeah, it, it basically is what it says. You can smell the Belgian, you can see the colour, and um, it's very refreshing. Not quite sour, you know, but you know, it's not a sour, and um, but it's just, just touching on that sourness. So quite a nice drink. Um, not sure how you get them, but I, well, I'm sure you have to be a member to get it. So Club Brewing, I'm sure you can check that out online. And um, that one there was the collaboration between Mountain Goat for the Hazed and Confused Belgian Promigana. Remember, life's too short to drink bad beers. Cheers, see ya.